Okay, the question is, how long should you cycle off of peptides? I like this question because it's a great opportunity to clear some things up because peptide cycling is completely different than cycling, say, something like testosterone. Uh, the, the big difference is that if you're taking an exogenous hormone, again, like testosterone, it's a replacement. So TRT is a great example of this. Uh, TRT is for life. You, it's not something that you're going to cycle on and off of because at some point when you take it long enough or if you take enough dosage for a long enough period of time, your body's going to be like, hey, we're good. We don't need to produce this anymore or it's going to produce less. Uh, a lot of people might do blast doses of testosterone that aren't on TRT, but they will have to do some type of cycling off or post-cycle therapy in order to maintain their own body's production. That's also where HCG comes in, so on and so forth, but that's a completely different story. So peptides. In this example, we'll talk about CJC1295 and ipamorelin. Those are signals. And what they do is they stimulate your body to produce more of, say, growth hormone in this example, or IGF-1. And the cycling that's involved here is completely different because all you're doing is you're trying to minimize desensitization so that your body remains receptive to the peptide and the peptide keeps working. So this is not about your body shutting down its own production. Again, completely different story. Now, as far as how long to cycle on and cycle off, the most conservative approach is a one-to-one -one ratio of on to off. So for example, if you're on a peptide for eight weeks, you take eight weeks off. Now, for me personally, I think that's a little bit overkill. I tend to do half that duration. So if I'm on a peptide for eight weeks, I tend to take four weeks off. If I'm on for six weeks, three weeks off, so on and so forth. But at the end of the day, you got to figure out what works for you and what works well for your body and how you are responding personally. So as always, if you haven't already, please download my products. They are free. The link is in my bio. And if you decide that you want to pick up some peptides, I highly recommend Amino Asylum. The discount code is BV20 for 20% off your order. Thank you.